The human centipede is the story of this guy. I'm Dr. Joseph Heiter. And it's quest for stitching people together, ass to mouth. The human centipede. Two pretty but ditzy American girls go on a road trip through Europe. In Germany, they miraculously get a flat tire and think the best idea will be to go wandering through the woods. They search for help in an isolated villa and wake up the next day in a horrifying uh, basement hospital thing with an Asian man. And that's about when things take a turn for the worse. The human centipede. Let's be honest. You're not seeing this movie for the story though, right? If you're as perverted as me, you want to see the gross centipede thing. So, well, here it is. Yeah, yeah. Mm. You're welcome. So now you have absolutely no reason to go and see the movie because it's horrible. Smart, bitch. The human centipede. The centipede itself is the highlight in this cavalcade of mediocrity that is this incredibly dumb film. The acting's poor and most of it's just done with the people's eyes, which is kind of funny. It's because they can't use their mouths. Centipede. The two main American characters are so annoying and crass that I breathed a heavy sigh of relief when they couldn't talk anymore as their asses were sewed into each other's mouths. The best scene in the movie depicts Dr. Heater. Hater? Heater explaining exactly how the centipede is going to work and watching the three segments of the centipede to be freak out at phrases like the first feeds the second the movie prides itself on how medically accurate it is it even goes as far as to display 100% medical accuracy as the tagline however the only thing accurate about this movie that I can see is how damn gross this would be in real life feed her, feed her. Smart, bitch! 